Yeah, um, good evening everybody. Um, my name is Peter Pfiffner. I'm not going to talk about my PhD, um, but because I do uh, research on medical robotics, um, but this is more like my project that I want to do after my PhD and that I plan for a couple of years now. Um, so the idea is that probably if you use the economical system for the average person it's quite okay and in a perfect world you probably want to have a relative um, low inequality be, uh, between the richest and the poorest person. Um, you want to have good education for everybody um, and you probably want to improve the life of everybody. Um, and the usual solutions to that um, are um, usually uh, developmental aid, um, building schools in those countries, and um, developing the economy. But um, when I lived in, in Honduras for six months, I was thinking, so why doesn't it work as good as I would expect it to work? Um, and I think a lot has to do with it that a lot of the economical system is, is not very transparent and not visible for uh, most of the people. And the average person probably doesn't understand it, actually. Um, and there was the accountability is relatively low in many countries. Um, so what if there was a tool that um, would allow for the average person to better understand the um, economical system by um, putting connections. If you read a news article, you usually read a couple of numbers, but you never see the connections between those numbers in the, in the big system. Um, and also there's a lot of small uh, bits and bytes of, of data, but it's never in a big data bank that it's all connected. Right? Um, so the idea is basically to, to do, um, present the economical system in a, um, in a fashion of a Google Maps or, or Wikipedia style. Um, and that could address issues like the, the uh, transparency for the economical system, the lack of knowledge, um, the lack of accountability often. Um, and if NGOs want to um, keep big companies accountable, they have a hard time just because they have less resources to do that. And on the other side, we have the technical issues of um, visualization, where we already heard one talk today. Um, not available data sometimes, and uh, the puzzle pieces not sticking together. Yeah. So 